Paying respects to lost loved ones, these families have held a memorial at the airport in the Ukrainian city of Dnipropetrovsk. It was from this airfield that their sons, brothers and husbands called for the last time, saying that everything would be fine. But everything was not fine. On June 14, 2014, 40 Special Forces soldiers and nine crew members took off for Luhansk, a city in East Ukraine now controlled by Russian-backed militants but at the time still under the control of the government. As the plane approached the Luhansk airport, it was shot down by the militants, taking the lives of everyone on board. The downing of the plane was the worst loss of life in a single event in Ukraine since the country had begun in February 2014 to fight the Russian-backed insurgency in its eastern regions, which continues to this day. The former head of Ukraine's anti-terror operations in the east, Major General Viktor Nazarov, has been accused of negligence which led to the plane being shot down. Human rights activists say he disregarded information warning that terror attacks were planned.